like, share, subscribe. Hey y'all, welcome back. Number 83 says, During a certain rainstorm, an empty rain barrel became filled with water. During the storm, the rain fell lightly at first, followed by a heavy downpour, followed by a lighter rain. Which of the following graphs could be a model for the height of the water, H, in the rain barrel at time T, where T is the amount of time that has passed since the storm began? Storm began. So really it's just going to be a matter of interpreting the rates of change or the slopes of these graphs in terms of what's going on in context with the problem. So it says at first the rain fell lightly. So the rain fell lightly at first followed by a heavy downpour, uh, followed by a lighter rain. So if the rain is falling lightly, so let me make a little note here. If the rain is falling lightly, then we should have a smaller rate of change. Okay, though basically the amount of water is going to increase slowly, slowly. So if the rain falls lightly, we're going to look for a, a section of the graph that has a, a small slope. Okay, and then the second part says it's followed by a heavy downpour. So, uh, so a heavy downpour means that it's raining more so uh, at a, a and the rain and the sorry the rain barrel should be. Um, filling up at a faster rate. So a heavy downpour indicates that we should have a larger slope or a steeper slope. And then we have, uh, and then it's followed by a lighter rain again. So we have a, a, you know, a slight slope followed by a more um, extreme slope and then we have the slow slope again. And really the only answer choice that even comes close to looking like that is going to be B here. Uh, you can see that the rain barrel, you know, it's filling up, but kind of slowly. And then as the rain increases in terms of, you know, how much rain is falling, a heavy downpour, it, the rain barrel should be, be filling up faster. And then it kind of slows off uh, when the rain becomes lighter. So there's really like three sections here, right? There's the first section. Uh, where the rain falls lightly. There's the second section here where we're followed by a heavy downpour. And then the third section is when the rain kind of lets up again. So there's not really, you know, there's no arithmetic or algebra here. It's just really about interpreting this graph in terms of uh, the description that's given in the problem. So our answer is B here, and that's it for number 83. Thanks for watching. Y'all have a great day.